St. John chapter 7, verse 38. He that believeth on me, as the scriptures have said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. Brakatai Hawa, Brakatai Hawa Shai, Brakatai Hawa, Brakatai Hawa Shai, Brakatai Hawa, Brakatai Hawa Shai. Call Halal Lai, Yahweh Bashimi Hawa Shai. All right, which is Hebrew, interpret. Bless Yahweh, bless Yahweh Shai. All praises to the Father, Yahweh, in the name of the Son, Yahweh Shai. I want to give double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Salutations to all the Lord's whole four elect scattered abroad, teaching his word of sincerity and truth. Shalom. All right, here's a video I came across from the brother GMS Vegas sit downs. And I believe this is the brother uh, Yashawamba, Elder Yashawamba out there in Dallas. All right. And um, he did a beautiful response to this character that you see on your screen, man. And I believe his camp goes by one body in Yahweh Shai, when in all reality, they're one body in Satan. All right, because if you think you're going to downplay the Lord's miracles, you out of your goddamn mind. All right. You know, it's always these guys with this setup. It's always, it's always, I'm, you know, it's always guys with this setup, you know, with this menorah, the desk, the studio. That's always going to fuck off, man. Excuse my friends. It just pisses me off because these guys claim to be, you know, circumcised, claim to be of the circumcision Israelites. But here it is. They're blasphemy, man. You know, they're going way to fuck off. All right. And really, you guys, these guys are bought out. You know, that's why me personally, you know, I tell you, you know, um, if you deal with any camp, deal with Great Millstone. All right. Because you can't go wrong. You know, Great Millstone is the camp. That the Lord set up, all right, to just give you the knowledge and wisdom and understanding from Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. Nothing else, all right? Nothing else but the word. That's it. Because these guys, you know, this is madness, man. But as the uh, brother El Eliyasha Wumba, all right, he uh, did his response and brought out some beautiful points, you know. Because uh, what will also come to my mind as well when, when Satan said he wanted to shift Peter like wheat. All right. Satan want to shift the Lord's elect if he can. All right. If it's possible. You know, but it's not possible according to scripture. Because Yahweh Shai said, neither can he, neither can you pluck one of these out of my hand. All right. Roughly paraphrasing. All right. And also, neither can you take away the faith that was given to the elect by Yahweh. Okay. But. You know, guys like this, they are, uh, you know, are set up to uh, pervert the gospel, you know, and to mislead, mislead, okay, the newly fruit, you know, helping Esau to uh, slow down prophecy, you know, so they think, all right? And I just got to call it the way I see it, man, unless the guy repent and, um, and, and, um, and, and show humbleness, man, and show humility, you know, show show uh sincerity in the truth because the way that he's kicking it out there you know he's making it seem like you know um that that uh yeah everybody's going to be bent out of shape it hurts no nigga you know you in trouble for bringing this out all right so i don't want to do too much of a rant i got a few scriptures it's not too many just my take and my response to this matter all right so i'm gonna play some of the video lord willing i hope you guys are edified so anything to show you god this is the way. Read. The two and verse two. And both your house shall was called. And both your house shall was called. Read. And his disciples and his followers. Read. To the marriage. To the marriage. Read. And when they wanted wine. And when they wanted wine. Read. The mother of your house shall. Why did he not call her Mary? It said mother. It's talking about the nation, man. Now this is this is see, you know him bringing his trying to trying to pervert the gospel, and this this been well studied and planned, you know to sit there because scoffers and men who sell sell out, you know have to study in order to pervert the gospel. They have to understand the truth first, and then throw in throw in the the monkey wrenches, man. All right. The stumbling blocks. All right. And whoever gets stumbled behind this character, you just not you're not of the whole four leg. All right. Because Yahweh Shai. All right. Turned 
at a wedding, okay, his first miracle recorded, as it is written, he turned water into wine. All right, Yahweh Shai did walk on water. Okay, Yahweh Shai did uh 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 what you call it um uh uh Salakia. Yahweh Shai did resurrect. Excuse me. All right, I'm thinking I got a lot of thoughts in my mind. I'm um, thinking other things he did. Okay, Yahweh Shai did these miracles, and he said we're gonna do even more. All right, so let me split the video. He's trying to say the wine that Yahweh Shai did. So you mean to tell me Yahweh Shai, he started to prophesize unto them? Because if you saying that water he turned into uh, wine is uh, false philosophies, all right? Satan poison, then he must have been what? Prophesizing to them at the wedding. Shake it off. Shake it off. Out your brains today. And, and and like and like the brother, like the elder said, Yasha Wumba, man. All right. He said they said he said they're nothing but an offspring of um IUIC. And him doing this little tactic is all neat. You can see IUIC in them. They just got different clothing on. All right. You know, Satan always trying to branch out. You know, I like to say Satan is uh he's like a wicked tree. With many different wicked branches. You know, which one you're going to get uh, stung upon. You know, which one you're going to stumble upon and get hung up on. You know. Read the, the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 32, verse 33. Read their wine is the poison of dragon. Their wine is the poison of dragon. They're toxic, man. It's the poison of dragons. Their doctrine is the poison of dragons. What doctrine? Is Yahweh Shai talking about when he turned water to wine? The doctrine of the wedding? What? Because they was rejoicing at a wedding? You know, he's not reading, he not even breaking down that scripture in the way that is written, and his way that is the concept of what is being said. You know, he's just trying to go off the, the word wine. All right. And there's some cases where uh the word wine actually does means false philosophy. But in this case, this is not that case. This is the case where Yahweh Shai actually did turn water to wine. All right. And if you know anything about wine, um, like uh, I forgot who brother put me on. But, you know, if you mix your if you got some wine and you put a dab, a little, well, yeah, a little bit of water mixed with it, it kind of tastes better. You know, for those that's wine drinkers. Baggage, man. That's what the devil does, man. He feeds your lies all day. Because he know you're not your mind lazy, man. He know you're not going to preach up nothing. He know you're not going to go work hard to go find it. What is the devil? What is the devil? He's basically saying any brothers or anybody out there teaching that Yahweh Shai turned water to wine is Satan. You This, this nigga is Satan, man. All right? This nigga is Satan. Uh, what the scriptures say, even Satan shall change it to an a, a, a angel of light. Roughly paraphrasing, all right? Because even Satan could quote scriptures, man. You know, now, um, I'm going to leave it there. I was going to go into a few precepts. As I read at the very beginning of the video, John 7 and 38, He that believeth for me, as the scriptures have said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. All right? Because if you speak the truth in sincerity and learn the truth, the 100% truth of the Bible, from the Old Testament to the New, to the new all right, because Yahweh Shai said he come in the volume of the book, not the volume of the New Testament, not the value of the Old Testament. He said of the book. All right. Meaning the book speaks of Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai is the word. OK, it says he that believeth on me, as the scriptures have said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. OK, meaning if you are a brother, you're going to be able to teach the word without being stumbled upon the stumbling blocks in the scriptures, you know. I believe this guy sat down and thought of that shit, man, and started to teach it. No, no telling how long in his camp he'd been teaching that. But that was well, well that was uh, well thought of. You know, that's not something you make a mistake. That that's something where you wanted to dig too deep, where where it wasn't even even no 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 waters, no deep waters to get into. You know, he just reaching. 
you know, but only ones that's going to get caught up behind that is those that's not of the whole four elect. All right. Those that's not of the elect. It says first uh, Timothy four and one. Now, the spirit speaketh expressly that in the latter times, some shall depart from the faith. And this guy clearly by teaching that against Yahweh Shai, downplaying his miracles, he departed from the faith. All right. Giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. All right. Because this man has a lying spirit on him. This guy has a lying spirit on him, man. OK. The whole setup is like IUIC. Man, every time I see somebody at these camps set up like this with this with this uh, background and I'm not saying I'm not saying they wicked because of the setup, but it's just like when these guys want to be so well put together and they want to be commercialized, you know, these guys are fucking off, man. The Lord deals with the lowly, man. That's why I teach our apostles and elders. All right. Of great millstone teachers. Just teach the scriptures, man. We ain't in it for the glamour and all that other shit. Theatrics and things like that. You know, this perfect setup, this whole politically correct setup. You know, we out there just to teach the word. We're men, man. All right. To the most high, turn us into what? Those turn us into the angelic power, man. You know, but right now we're just men, man. We out here to teach the word in our sackcloth and give you the hundred percent truth, man. And and to give it to you uh raw. All right. Raw and uncut, man. The way the the way the Lord said it is how we gonna speak it, man. All right. So like you. Um it says, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils, man. That is a doctrine of a devil. He's attacking Yahweh Shai on the low. All right. And brothers picked it up, man. You know, he's attacking Yahweh Shai. And he's supposed to be in, in, this, in the body of Yahweh Shai. He's in a body, one body of Satan, man. You know, these guys are prideful as hell. And the Lord going to set you dudes straight, man. You know, for going the fuck off, man. All right. So this is Ephesians chapter 6 and 12. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood. And see another thing too. And like the elder brother was saying, man, that in this video, that um, see, GMS always get the get get all the, the backlash because GMS, through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashmiah Shah, is the only brothers that's out there defending the gospel, man. Ain't none of these other camps, you know, like Zabak and them going, bitch. Well, you know, all these other different camps, and I use Zabak an example. They're not going to get on this guy. They're not going to say nothing about it. You know, that's that, that's what's funny when when you set you set you sent forth to defend to defend the gospel. You know, you don't supposed to be uh, getting along with guys that's going off on doctrine. You can't be wanting together. I'm thinking about the unity camps. You can't be together if you all speak not a one court, man. If you're all speaking different things, the different names of the Lord and different doctrines of the scriptures, how can you possibly think that y'all all together? <laughs> all right. And because they think because these guys are so femininized, fem fem feminine. All right. Here in the States, here in America in 2019, that they think by, you know, rebuking on camera and and and, and getting a brother, you know, Correcting a brother, you know, and, and his going off on the scriptures is um uh, is not brotherly love. It's slander. It's not slander, man. All right, if you're using scriptures, you know, but it's okay because great millstone will be to hate it, and that's cool. All right, because that's how it's supposed to be. You know, the scriptures say they hate of him that rebuketh in the gates. All right, and Yahweh Shah was not loved, he was hated more by many than the ones. That was given to him that loved him, man. All right. He was hated from by the world, man. Okay. Now, this is um Ephesians chapter 6 and 12. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. We need faith. Okay. Esau has witchcraft, man. Okay. He has spiritual powers on the left hand side. How in the hell be able to over over overtake him, all right, without having spiritual powers? You know, I don't I don't even believe these guys um teach about spiritual powers if they taking away the spiritual powers of Yahweh Shai. All right, you know this devil has technology that's out of this world. It's really, you know, uh, how can I say, his technology is witchcraft, man. You know, spiritual powers. It says, 
For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of darkness of this world. That's Satan, man. Okay? That's demon, that's this demon spiritual Satan. Okay, and also the counterpart Esau. It says against spiritual wickedness in high places. They're conjuring up spirits, they're talking to demons. Us brothers in the faith of Yahweh Bashim al Shah, we ain't doing that. We're praying to the Lord, to the invisible power. With faith, you know, uh, believing in, in his word and his promises. This is what helps brothers get through. So he's trying to attack y'all faith, man. It says, um, against the rulers of darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of Yahweh, that ye may be able to withstand in the evil day. And having done all to stand. All right. And that's the faith in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. By learning the scriptures, receiving the knowledge and the wisdom. Because as the scriptures say, the knowledge and wisdom shall be the stability of thy times. Because without that, you're not going to make it. You're not built up for the day of the battle. And the day of the battle started, man. Okay. The day of the battle have started because there's a, there's a war. All right. On your mind. There's a war on your spirit. And if you're not fighting a good fight and enduring, then you're going to be overtaken. Okay. You know, so for you guys out there, you know, that are listening to these different camps, you got to stop listening to them. It's, I'll tell you, listen to Great Millstone, man. All right. This is not about uh, who got the most men, who get the most views, um, whatever you call it. This is a, hey, if you the elect, the hopeful elect, because that's who we, we preach this gospel to. And we also... Uh, tell these other nations, you know, their uh, judgment. You hopeful elect, you know, get the truth and, and get it with sincerity, man. All right. So, you know, with that, I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Rakakodash. I like to give double honors to my apostles and elders at Great Millstone. Salutations to all the Lord's hopeful elect. Shalom.